intensive and extensive properties. Consider a gas enclosed in a 2 liter vessel at 80 degree Celsius. The vessel is partitioned to two equal half. What will be the volume of the gas in each compartment? It will be 1 liter each. Temperature 3 ariko. 80 degree de pagidi, 40 degree ariko. Ado 80 degree de niyano. It is 80 degree Celsius. Apa idhe window kanta idhe bhiyadi kya? Porendne volume half liter be the mari kunda wa. But the temperature continued to be at 80 degree Celsius. What you can understand from this example? Puri vastu vinde. Volume, gas in the amount of marana in surgit, maricunde iricu. Ether thriller property, extensive properties in the brain. But what about temperature? Substance in the quantity marumbo, temperature maranilla. Ether thriller property, intensive properties in the brain. So properties are divided into two. Extensive property and intensive property. Extensive property depends on the amount of the substance that is taken. For the Maladikina, Pastuvinde, amount of Marubo, you property go matam very. Intensive properties do not depend on the amount of the substance that is taken. Upper substance in the amount of Marubo. Property now, let us see some examples. Mass. Put a substance in the mass. A mold in a dependent you know, illio and the nichi decant another. But I'm the lericumbo, then a mass of good the lericu. Coravan and the mass, coravai. So, mass is an extensive property. Pressure, I'm a bucket lay, two dollar vegetunded. You will let in the a glass is a little bit of a little bit of a temperature bit so temperature will not depend on the amount of the substance so temperature is an intensive property number of moles amount of number of moles that is number of moles is an extensive property volume so volume is an extensive property for concentration Concentration is nothing but N by V. That is number of moles by volume. Suppose we are dividing the given solution into two equal parts. Then what happens? Number of moles will become N by 2. Volume will become V by 2. And what about concentration? N by 2 by V by 2 will be equal to N by V. But volume concentration after division into two equal parts is same as the concentration before dividing into two parts. So concentration will not depend on the amount of the substance. So concentration of a solution is an intensive property. So molarity, normality, mole fraction, mass percentage, all concentration units will be intensive in nature. Energy. One liter of petrol in the energy, one liter of petrol in the energy, same or no? Allah. So, energy depends upon the, the amount of the substance. So, energy is an extensive property. So the energy forms that we are studying are internal energy, enthalpy, free energy, entropy. All these properties are extensive in nature. Heat capacity. Heat capacity is the, the amount of heat required to increase the temperature of a substance through 1 degree Celsius. For the degree the substance in the alamu kudumbo, temperature 1 degree increase here avashumaya heat in the alamu kudum. So heat capacity is a extensive property. Specific heat. Specific heat in the varayana the one kilogram substance in the temperature one degree increase here in the heat angle. Apa amount fix agumbo automatically the property becomes intensive property density density is amount fixed this mass per 
unit volume. So density is intensive. All molar properties will be intensive in nature. Just now I told you the enthalpy, internal energy, etc. are extensive. But molar enthalpy, molar entropy in the variable that is intensive by money. For heat capacity, just now we have seen is extensive. But say the amount of fixed heat molar heat capacity in the variable that becomes intensive in nature. Boiling point. One liter water boils at 100 degrees Celsius. Two liter water that also will boil at 100 degrees Celsius. So boiling point will not depend on the amount of the substance. So boiling point is intensive in nature.